Hey, um, my name is Nikki Taylor. Um, I'm here to say what's on my mind basically about this PSA 12 step commercial that we're putting together. Never ever was I a gay member, never ever was I like a bad kid. I just happened to turn the wrong road and I got back on track because I've always wanted to be a writer and I wrote two books. Um, after the first book, I killed up my house party, it was like I was lost because nobody had been there and done that to come back and share any stories with us or help us to know that, you know, this is how it's going to go, this is how it happens. We just thought maybe that was the first time and that hopefully that was going to be the last time, but no, I didn't been to like maybe over like, oh, 40 something funeral. Good afternoon. My name is Jeanette Allen. I really thank God for really being an advocate for our kids in this community because we have so many kids that's around here that really need support that they don't have now. So this is a good thing for our community right now. We need more parents involved, we need more fathers, a lot, really, really a lot more fathers involved. So those that, um, that feel that they can, even if they just give a, a good word, I'm asking that you just really come and help us to support our community and our kids. Hi, my name is Hanifa Dudley. I've been born and raised in Portland, Oregon. I've uh, been here all my life. I've been affected by games on um, many different facets. Um, me and Nikki go way back. Uh, I had a brother who was in the game um, who got killed actually two blocks from here. And it took me like 15 years to even come down this street. So um, this is a good moment. These are my three kids, Andre, Kayla, and Gianna. Um, I'm very proud today to be a part of this production because it's very important for our community to understand that it's just not the people in the gang that are affected by the violence. But it's the little sisters, the little brothers, the nieces, the nephews that won't have the opportunity to meet that family member because of the loss. The whole community hurts behind loss. The whole family hurts behind loss. Lives are changed completely. Um, sometimes I think about, I don't even know where my life would be had that not happened, but I'm grateful that God gave me the strength to get through it and to use that pain as a motivator to make sure that I made something out of my life, to make sure that I was there for my kids, that I'm their backbone, that I instill strength, knowledge. They see me go through the pain, but they see me come through it. And I think that's a great testimony to how strong we are as people. And uh, I'm just grateful. I'm grateful to be standing here because I could have been a statistic um, but I chose to do something different with my life not saying better but just different because I saw the outcome of what that brings um, I see the hurt in my mom's eyes that will never go away uh, a pain that will never be soothed it can't be rubbed it can't be taken away but I think the only thing that changes that is love the whole other end of the spectrum of loss. Um, I'm just grateful. My name is Cameron Witten. I am 21 years old. I am a community activist and I'm a student at Portland Community College Cascade campus. And I have to say that I'm greatly affected by gang violence here. And I know many pastors, such as Pastor Hennessy, who has to have uh, many uh, funerals hosted at his church for victims of gang violence. And even there, people aren't safe at these funerals. And we have so much hostility in our community. While we are victims of you know, economic pressures, and there's still system, systemic racism going on. And this is an important time for us to come together and realize our unity instead of continuing to fight each other. And so I'm out here saying that I support this cause. I support what Nikki's doing. And I really believe that we should support her and our community as much as possible because that's the only way we will be able to stop the violence. Growing up in the hood, young boy, 1984, with the gear, my peers didn't know what was in store. A little hard hit kick came of age, time to pay my dues, learn the tricks of the... Game banging ain't cool, stay in school.